If you are looking to completely remove Windows 11 and install Ubuntu as your main operating system, you have come to the right place. In today's video, I'll walk you through the entire process step by step. So let's dive right in. Once we remove Windows 11, all files on your hard drive will be gone forever. So before we get started, it's critical to back up your important data. Save your important files to an external drive or cloud storage. Now, we need to download the latest version of Ubuntu. Visit the official Ubuntu website. Download the ISO file for Ubuntu desktop. Download Rufus from rufus.ie Now, let's create a bootable USB drive. For this, you will need a USB drive with at least 8 GB of storage. Plug in your USB drive and open Rufus. Select the Ubuntu ISO you downloaded. Click Start. Once the process is finished, your bootable USB is ready to use. Now, to boot from your USB, you will need to access the BIOS or UEFI settings. Restart your computer. Navigate to the boot menu and select your USB drive to boot from it. Once you have booted from the drive, you will see the Ubuntu installation screen. Select try or install Ubuntu to proceed. Now follow the steps to completely remove Windows 11 and install Ubuntu. Choose your preferred language. Select your keyboard layout, for example English US. Connect to a Wi-Fi network if available. Alternatively, you can skip this step if you are using a wired connection or no internet. Click Next. Check those two boxes to include drivers and codecs for proprietary hardware and media formats. Now you have to choose how you want to install Ubuntu. Here, you need to select Erase Disk and install Ubuntu. This will completely remove Windows 11 and all its data on your drive. Next, enter user details like your name and computer's name and choose a username and password. Select your time zone on the map or from the drop down menu. Click install now and confirm. The installer will now copy files, install packages and configure your system. During the installation, you will see a slideshow highlighting Ubuntu's features. Wait for the process to complete. After the installation is complete, you need to restart your computer. Remove the installation USB drive when prompted and press enter. Now boot into your newly installed Ubuntu system. You will be greeted by the Ubuntu login screen. Enter your credentials and you are good to go. And that's it. You have successfully removed Windows 11 and installed Ubuntu as your primary operating system.